with our offense, uh, you know, even three one is, is very difficult to come back from right now. So uh, certainly, you know, that was a, was a huge blow, uh, but I thought we were in great shape up until uh, the penalties and, and the, uh, you know, LeBate jumped on the ice too soon, uh, get put us down five on three. So, uh, you know, they're both obviously big turning points for us because I, I loved our first period, you know, it was one of the best periods we played all year and uh, got the lead because we talked about not chasing the game. So it was unfortunate though, you know, that sequence to, you know, give up two uh, on the PK. And then, uh, you know, the, the, certainly that was the dagger there that uh, made it very difficult for us. When you break down the game, uh, the first period, okay, well, you're going to like that, obviously. But were there other parts of the game that you felt the team was playing well or at least was showing some comeback potential? Well, I mean, I thought there was certainly some opportunity to score and, uh, you know, the, the kid made some 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 saves. Uh, you know, I thought the Castellic line was was probably our best line from start to finish. Uh, you can see that they're gaining confidence uh, shift by shift, game by game. Um, so that's certainly a positive. Uh, you know, I thought Thompson uh, was, you know, one of his better games. Uh, I thought he was more quiet. When I say more quiet, uh, he was managing the puck better. So, you know, when you look at that type of, of play from those four kids, uh, that's a positive. What about the veteran side of it? I mean, Formington got a goal late on the power play. He's been struggling. Did you see at least a sigh of relief from him that might unlock his potential? Uh, you, I, I, there's certainly some possibilities there. We, you know, we tweaked the uh, power play uh, after the, a second period and uh, you know I called the timeout there because Sokolov was on the ice a, a long time uh, so you know we wanted to get a look with him on the flank with Brown on the other side to see uh, and then put Shaw uh, net front so uh, that was why I called the timeout and uh, it certainly paid off with for me getting the goal and uh, Brown you know getting on the score sheet as well but uh, you know certainly uh, you know some of our players that have played in the American League, uh, whether it's one, two, three, four years experience, um, you know, certainly going to, you know, we need more from, uh, from these guys. Uh, you know, I think the kids are coming along, like I said, shift to shift, game to game, but at the end of the day, you, you know, uh, they're not going to uh, lead us to victory on a game, on, on a night to night basis. You know, they're, they're part of the team right now. That's, you know, that's, uh, you know, just getting their feet. Um, you've mentioned quite a bit off the top here about Sokolov. I'm just wondering about his development and what, what you've seen in him, maybe even from the start of camp. Um, what, you know, or is this a normal progression or are you seeing a lot that maybe uh, him grow into, into his position here in the AHL? Well, I, I think his, his growth is, is certainly, you know, game to game and, you know, it's, first few games, you know, specifically in uh, Montreal versus Laval, you could tell that he was processing the game and the systems and, um, you know, he was a half a second behind at times just because he was, um, you know, not overthinking it, but, you know, sometimes when you're thinking the game, your feet don't react as quickly. Um, so that is one of the biggest improvements I've seen, you know, from the first, you know, set of games to, to coming back and starting to play against Stockton and, and obviously he's found the back of the net and he's getting his chances and uh, he's, he's a big body, strong, he's physical um, and he's showing some quickness uh, that, uh, you know, maybe was, at least we were told was part of his weakness, you know, so uh, there's lots to like and uh, I suspect as he continues to get his offensive chances and, and feel good about his game, uh, that he's going to continue to improve. But, uh, you know, I've got no issues right now with uh, the three rookie forwards of Kastelik, Sokoloff, and Reinhardt. Uh, I'd like to see Reinhardt get, get a goal because uh, I think that would really help his confidence because he's such a smooth skater. Um, you know, he's certainly not as quick as or fast as Formington, but he's got some, some great speed. And 
Uh, he's got some some bite to his game, so uh, there's lots of light to him. And and then obviously Thompson is is improving uh, game to game as well. So uh, that's important.